GB Director, we have this concept called the stage. Broadly speaking, you can use the stage in two different ways. In this chapter, we're going to focus on using the stage as a traditional preview. Let's take a real world example. Let's suppose a clip arrives late in the production. We're already on air. I can't just punch it straight in like I was doing previously. I need to preview it. So in this case, I simply come to my GV Director panel. I open up the stage. I then select the clip, in this case GV Director, I want to preview. You can see that's now rolling on my stage channel. Yes, I'm happy, that is the clip that I want. And I press the Take button. And that clip is now on air and re-queued. I can also preview other kinds of production elements. Let's suppose I want to preview a graphic to make sure that the text is correct. I simply open up the stage, go to my Effects tab, choose the particular graphic I'm interested in. In this case, you can see that Dylan Jones is, in fact, the right graphic. I press the Take button, and that graphic is now on air. Lastly, I can also preview transitions. Let's put a clip into the stage, as we had previously. And this time, I want to override the currently selected program transition with this cube effect. I can rehearse this particular effect in the stage, seeing the transition and the clip together. And when I'm happy with that, I press the Take button. And now both of those things, the background element, in this case a clip, and the transition are now on program. As you can see, using the stage for a preview is a great way to check out particular production elements before you take them to air.